Let me get the camera off the butt. That was the last little sound bite that we got. I mean, on one hand, that does seem a little and sexy. And sexy, yeah. And a little Natural. bit. He's a little smart. bit. He's a smart man. He knew what he was doing. He does. <laughs> and, and honestly, I really feel like he was promoting himself <clears throat> yeah. as well as you. So it, it was did, just like it, a win-win yeah. situation. I think it did um, bring him back to like that. He actually was one of the first rappers online that the new, the new media was like about to take over. So he kind of caught on to that quick. And then he kind of figured Cheeks, camera, my life. You know, people were intrigued. He was smart about it. People were intrigued by you, and that yeah, is um, that's something that's rare. My question to you is, what are your thoughts on his, I'm not going to say who, his, mm -hmm. new girl, Esther Baxter? Have you... Sexy girl. No, I've, I worked with her. Um, you know, we went out to Baton Rouge. Uh, Megan Good um, wrote and produced a movie called uh, Video Girls, and I had the opportunity to be invited and just have a cameo. So we went out there, and at the time, I think they weren't together. Who knows? No, I think they weren't together whatever met her she's a very sweet girl you know shout outs to her and joey i hope they're happy like i have wow. no thoughts wow no animosity are you guys Why friends we? now no, no no i mean if i see i haven't seen her since we're i agree i mean her. you and him oh, me and him yeah no, we're not we, we don't speak Damn. It is what it is. I mean, you know, I feel one, her. One thing I want to know is that, you know, she, he's dated all of these beautiful women. He's, Do you think listen, that... Listen, he's a charmer. That's all I have to say. Mm -hmm. His roster it looks real it's, good. Yeah, yeah, it does. They're, they're sexy women. But also, do you think that he's the same man with every woman? Or is he a I, different I man? Would you know? Know? I would know. I would know. I think that, you know, her. he's a smart man. I think that experiences, you know, they, they, you, you learn, you know, just by going through situations. I'm hoping he's, you know, a better man to her. And, you know, just like I learned a lot in my relationship and the next relationship which I am right now <laughs> I'm not what are you anti-relationship right now I'm not I'm not I don't think I'm ready yeah, you know I, right. I'm going on dates and yeah. stuff yeah. you know my relationship was pretty the breakup was pretty ugly so um you know I'm hoping he's better and I, of course I'll be better although I was kind of great to begin with but you know what I'm saying <laughs> basically <laughs> I'm just gonna get his loss his <laughs> loss pretty much now people want to know mm -hmm. did you date 50 cent mm -hmm. and did you date <laughs> DJ pro style I did not date 50 cent um, and the pro style actually we almost got married uh, what Whoa. Whoa. that was that was, uh, that was before Joey um, wow. before wow. Joey I uh, he happened to be a DJ in town I was unaware I was going for the whole Apple, Apple bottom thing and um, you know went to a concert we met through a mutual friend who was representing him and we just shook hands and forgot about it then weeks later, I hear that he's talking about this girl online and on the radio over there in Orlando. I had no idea. You know, I just knew he was just a DJ or whatever. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a different world. Um, and, you know, we kind of kept in contact. And then, uh, you know, we got together and we stayed together for about a year and a half, almost two. And it was pretty serious. Family, wow. living wow. situation. So it wasn't, again, a groupie situation. It was so kind of, it was my boyfriend. You're a relationship type of girl. Let's put yes, that Yes, which there. is why I'm having a hard time now because now it's, 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 it's hard for a girl in 2010. I'm the same. Thing. Everybody just want to do everybody and then mm -hmm. come back and do each other and then do yeah, it. And I'm not ready. Yeah, the industry I mean, so I'm not small. ready, it's but small. like, I'm, I don't want to be, I don't want to be used goods. Mm -hmm. So, so thank I you. stick That's to my relationship. With that being said, you being a relationship girl, would you, are you opposed to dating anybody else in the industry? Or is it something that, that you look at it like, it's just a job. This is a person that I like. It. And it's, it's beyond that because I'm not gonna lie to you. I put people in boxes. Like I put them yeah. all in a box. Athletes, rappers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, like because the game is so fickle. Like it is. and and being just you know a little spot in it and me watching and, and me being you know dated people in it. It's just so hard that even if you don't want to, you kind of put them all in a box. Mm -hmm. um, am I opposed to dating anybody in the game? I never say never because I said never before at Pro Style. And I wound up Pro Style. And then I was like, never. And then I wound up with Joey, you know. Right. Uh, I, I believe it's just all in the in the places you surround yourself. You know, you go out, you rub bubbles with those kind of people. Yeah. And you wind up dating them. You work in a hospital. You I date love a, your answer. You, you right. date a nurse or you date a doctor, doctor. You know, so, I mean, at the end of the day, I'm not opposed. Uh, I don't know. Um, I would say... Who knows? You know, it's right. not about what the person does, it's about the actual, you know, chemistry, the, the connection that two people have. Um, now, I know that, you know, I've, I've read a lot of the comments that you got for a lot of the videos that mm -hmm. you did. And for some reason, I think that um, our 
our society, our hip hop culture right. is fixated on calling females groupies, right. not realizing that there are a lot of men who are groupies, Worse than who girls. only want girls that are models and right. they only want girls that are in the spotlight or whatever it is. Right. Now, what are you know? What would you say mm -hmm. to those who want to label you as a groupie just because you dated guys that were in the limelight? I, they don't, you know. I can't. I don't really knock them because I. They don't really know me. You know, they know what they see. They know what they hear. Um, they don't know my past. They don't know that I knew my first. The first guy I dated for many years. You know, that we just met out there when he. I was 17 and he was like 19 maybe, and he was an artist that was trying to develop himself, and now he happens to be very famous. Like he. They don't know the facts mm -hmm. they just know what they see now and it's this girl that came out of nowhere in a cover magazine and these guys that are you know that are out there and now my business being out there so I, I really don't care you know I'm happy mm -hmm. with who I am and you know all these guys I still except for maybe Joey still have great relationships with them and um, we go out to dinner we're great like I don't really pay attention to the whole groupie thing I don't run around trying to get that guy I don't care you know I've seen women in clubs saying hurry up he's right there and I'm like wait huh? what yeah. yeah and I'm like how do you know he wears a helmet like these football yeah. like how do you know like right. can I get football for now, dummies well, talk a little bit about um, your calendar that right. you have out right now and um, just all the, the new things that you're working on okay. since that whole incident well um my calendar sh I shot in St. Lucia um, mm, right wow. and the behind the scenes are uh, part of the whole package uh, it's pretty amazing uh, pretty much, I just really, after that one cover, I got that little bug and I said, I want this calendar. Like, certain things, you know, as a female when you're a teen, you're like, I want to do this, I want to do that. And again, I was blessed with the opportunity. And it's pretty much amazing. Um, Y'all see the cover. Uh, it's 12 months of Tahiri, including that hot cover I'm going to make into a poster. And um, it's doing very well online right now.